Have you been asked what is your dream? You know, there are two types of dreams regarding my experience and what I've seen around. We have the true dreams and we have the shiny object syndrome where you feel like the society is pushing this way. So I have to focus on that dream. So today's uh, message is about the true dream. How can you figure out that this is your true dream? A true dream, you know your why. You know why you are doing that. And the why is not focused on yourself. It is focused on other people. Yes, other people. All those people you have heard, Facebook, Mark Zuckerberg, um, Bill Gates, all these people that you have heard, their dreams, analyzing their dreams, they didn't focus on their self. This is what I have realized. They focus on their purpose. They focus on the other person, how to help them to also make themselves happy and also help those people to be happy. So what is your why? Do you know your why? Why those dreams? And also you have to know your problems, problems you want to solve. You know, assuming an example, assuming you want to be a doctor. The reason why you wanted to be a doctor um, is that um, you realize that in your neighborhood there is no clinic there. People are dying. People are suffering medically, health-wise. People are having problems. And this really touched your heart so much that you want to work on your dreams you want to work on that dream that's to save the society so you are planning to be a doctor and you have connection with it the connection between that dream and yourself is so strong that you can't wait to start work even those doubts are entering into your mind that i can't do it do you think you can do it is your family do they have anything related to that? Like a lot of thoughts are coming into your mind, but still the connection is still strong. Then I will tell you that if you have anything related to the three things, your why, your why, the problem you want to solve and the connection you have with the dream, then you are in, on, on the step of moving to your true dream, not your shiny object syndrome. So I'll love you to focus on your dream. It's not any dream that pop into your mind that you think that it's your dream. Sit down and assess yourself and assess if this is really your thing you want to do. The reason why you have to do that is that when the billows of life hits you hard, you still focus on that dream because you know what you want. You know the energy behind it, the motivation, everything behind it is so strong that you want to achieve that. So I will need you to sit down, reflect, and make a final decision what your dreams are. And come back and tell me what you think. And also, if you have done, if you try to do that and you need help, you need an assistant from a life coach, from an advisor, you can DM me. Yes, DM me. Or send an email to advisory at Bridget, A -A -Japan com. Yeah. So, see you in the next elevation ladder. I want to see you do great things. I can't wait to see you do great things. So, see you.